On this uh, 1979 Evinrude 150 horse V6, <clears throat> uh, all together, I cleaned and rebuilt the carbs. I went to, uh, I checked the ignition system. Um, it was only sparking on uh, the top and not the bottom ones on this side. It's sparking on all three on, on the left side. Somebody replaced the coil packs and power pack on this side. Um, and when I went to go check spark, it was only sparking on the top cylinder on the right side, not the bottom two. I replaced the power pack on it and uh, we're getting spark on all three cylinders on the right hand side now. Um, yeah, uh, went to the carbs, placed the power pack. I think I did some other stuff too. I checked the spark and compression and uh, yeah. I have my battery and gas tank hooked up to it right now. I replaced the spark plugs too. That's what, another thing. Yeah, um, new power pack, new spark plugs, went to the carbs, I um, think that's it. Um, I'm having to use my battery and cables um, because with his hooked up, which I saw real quick. Have my jumper box just to raise and lower the motor. Um, with his, I cleaned off all the uh, terminals and everything on his battery cables and stuff. Um, and it's still, it was slow, it's cranking the motor over slow, even with my battery hooked up to it and everything disconnected, um, from the battery, except for the motor itself. Uh, it was still slow cranking. So I have my, uh, battery cables hooked up to the, straight to the motor. So that's another thing that's going to have to be addressed is the battery cables are gonna have to get swapped out still but that's pretty much it